fish guys. And we travel all over in pursuit of getting underwater footage of tropical fish. The same tropical fish most of us keep in our aquariums. On the Fish Guys documentaries, George Fear and Ivan Mikolji will take you to remote locations and show you exactly what they are willing to go through to get you a front seat view of all the aquatic habitats. Be a part of their adventures on the Fish Guys. I think we're at right. All right. So anyway, there's there's a piranha. There's a piranha spot close by. Well, I, I think it's like an hour south of here where we are. And we called it the, the death hole. <laughs> it's like a little pool in which we have seen like 200 piranhas at the same time. Right next it. to the road. Right next to the road. I've been there with probably six or seven people. After we saw, we, we threw a cast net in. The cast net in came came out like I don't know with 160 200 pounds of of piranhas, a big ball. The cast net was just a big ball of cariba, and it lasted 10 20, 20 seconds. And the whole cast net was gone. They ate the cast net. Nobody wants to get in that hole. So I'll get if, in that hole. If you get in that hole, get in that hole. We're gonna start this feeding frenzy. We're gonna do as many as possible. There's large amounts of Kariba this year and we're, they're pretty large. This can be pretty dangerous once you have 200 of these swimming around and on a feeding frenzy. See this distance here? See how thick that is? That's for scraping algae. This distance right here, this thickness. Piranha is extremely small. What day is today? We should have done this trip a years, years ago. Remind me. Next time. A garbage bag for the front seat of the car, along with a, a different catering service. Wow, look at that. That's a papaya that fell off a truck. Uh, you want it? Grab it? I don't. I'm, I don't need that. I don't need it. I want to get it for a picture. Is it any good or rotten? No, it looks good. Oh, we can give it to somebody. This is a papaya. Oh, papaya. Yeah. It fell off somebody's truck. Or we'll get a picture of one on a tree. Right, green ones because they're they're they grown around here. Everybody's got a couple of papaya trees in their backyard. We can give it to somebody. You want to put it in the back? In the yeah, I don't want a baby stool. Yeah, yeah, let's put it in the cab. That's all dirty. Oh. <laughs> What's your point? I, I think you're going to be amazed at how difficult this is going to be to draw. Well, it shouldn't, get, it shouldn't get full of water, right? No, understood. But even to draw oxygen below, that much down below the surface of the water. Why don't why don't we use a manual pump? Or like a bicycle pump. A bicycle pump. A bicycle pump. You know, I pump for five minutes, then you know we, we take turns and you know you you get in and you know I get in and you pump. Uh, okay. 
Yeah, uh, basing on the, 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 the volume of air that can come out of that. This works. 